consolidation of research. So that's what this is about. So we're going to attack the king. Bait, well, baiting a pawn. The pawn's already gone. Let's take. And let's castle king safety. Shall we x-ray through to the queen? And develop the knight. And shall we actually develop the rook this time? I was just going to blast onto the pawn here. Queen's coming down for the b-pawn. Always for the b-pawn. Let's just block that off. In my head, I'm thinking the picture doesn't look too bright yet. He's now actually coming attacking the pawn here. Let's just bring this rook in supporting. Could still potentially bring it in. What's he targeting? Targeting here. Could still bring this in because if he does take knight is on the queen and the bishop. We do have an isolated pawn in the center so it's probably an idea to either get rid of this pawn or see if we can get it into a threat of promotional area but it's a bit too early for that so i don't think it's going to survive being an isolated pawn so one of them's going i think we continue with just taking here and i'm going to take the rook Bring the queen here. There's potential for attacking the queen. Looking to get the rook off the board, maybe. Isolated pawn supported by the knights. Not too heavy, really. It's not too good. That might be our little bit of weakness. Knights ready to jump here. And if the rook took, then if the rook came down, we take. So that's all right. It's probably what they're thinking about doing. They are thinking about doing it, but they're doing it with the support of the um, queen. And it also takes away the sting from our bishop coming here attacking their queen. But I do believe that's what they're going to do. I don't have an attack on them, do I? Rook could come here, but his knight is protecting. So we could bring the knight here attacking their knight, but his knight can still come here. He's got a fork on the bishop as well. Mm. Tricky times, but is it as tricky as what I'm making it out to be? We know the knight's coming here. We could move the queen up, but I really wanted to trade off the rook. If we went and did that, his knight comes here. He's attacking our queen. But we do have a check on the king. Yep. Okay. I think we're going to do that. Knight's chomping here. We we'll take with a check on the king. Wins us a bit of tempo to hopefully, fingers crossed, not because he's going to have queen on the bishop and there, but we still have the diagonal with the queen going to take well, so we're going to lose that tempo we know he's going there so we can change our we could come here couldn't we but his knight can still go there could go here looking for a oh it's not a back rank though because his knight is protecting that square hmm right calculate calculate that is the danger square I could take this knight off the board. I don't know why I'm deliberating, sat there doing calculation. Right. Right. So, if we get the knight up. Oh, in fact, we could get the queen across now. Looking for a back ranker. That's not going to happen, obviously. It's going to defend or push a pawn. Okay, right, just keep it simple. He could get a back ranker eventually on, our, on us, so we need to make sure that we're making space for ourselves as well. Oh, he's blocking off, so it could end up being a draw, couldn't it? Can I squeeze in? I don't 
I think I want to squeeze in, do I? Let's go here. And now it's the magical night situation. Let's get the night up. Isolated pawn. I'm going to have to... I don't think I'm going to be fast enough. No, he's dancing already. If we attack his pawn, give him something to think about with the knight, or... No, he's coming here. Attacking... Let's attack his pawn with defending. He's coming here to attack that one, so... Do we just do this before any of that business because he's coming here? And then he's coming here, defending. So the knight's the. Oh, the king's going to get my knight. So I'm going to lose the pawns. I'm too slow. I can feel it in my, You know, when you feel it in your bones that you're just a little bit too slow, then the king starts moving over. So he moves, moves, yeah, yeah. Let's move. Come on, come on, come on, king. Can you sprint? If I could get my king here, but I don't think I'm fast enough. Can you sprint? Sprint. Sprint. I'm hoping his night moves cost him a little bit of time. Sprint, sprint, sprint. He's got a poor majority on this side, so it could be a draw or we're going to lose out and get Zugs wanged. Just pushing the pawn, maybe to try and meet any of this sort of stuff. But I think they may come here, but maybe that's even better for us. So then if he does this... Just going to go for basics. You know he's going for this. Let's take this way. Let's take this. Going for. He's got my pawns. I'm gonna have to go for the knight. This is highly elevated. If he moves the knight, hope, fingers crossed, we can get this pawn and dance. Oh, what we're we gonna do? Just move this. It's gonna be a draw, isn't it? Is it? Okay, Knight could do some fancy business like coming around here, seeing if it's going to attack, but then I'm going to lose these pawns. Put the check. He goes hiding in the corner, backwards and forwards with the Knight. I don't see there's any point attacking here, he's just going to attack the Then we go back again. Then if he moves there. That looks a bit risky to me. Okay, let's attack it. Oh, man. I didn't even see any of that, did I? Take. Oh, he's blocked my king in. This hasn't turned out the way I thought it was going to turn out. Let's bring the knight here. I'm going to have to bring the king backwards. That's not good. Knight's got a check. So if the king goes across, our king can go... Oh, but then I don't think we're gonna 
they still blocked us in. Ah, this is not good. Why did I move? I don't think I should have moved. Yeah, I should have just gone for the draw on position. I think I got carried away. Yeah, he's going to get my pawn. And his king's just going to keep blocking our king. It's not going to allow our king to get to here. And he, yeah. Oh, he has allowed. Oh, no, that's, yeah, that's, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 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 that's not right. But he's allowed us. He's allowed us to do it. But yeah, his king could have come down and got our pawn. He's under pressure like myself. He takes the pawn, we get a queen, put and a check on his king. Oh, excellent. Well, yeah, a bit I think a bit shady in the end bit, but you know, I'm not even gonna do an evaluation on it. Um it ended up the way it ended up. Um based on what we calculated as best possible. I was very scared. I don't think, in fact, you know, I, I am actually going to do it. Uh, ooh. Let's just, where did I think it was went wrong? Hey, it's in our favor. Didn't need to worry. Excellent. Right, okay, so we'll put the check on decided to move away from and then start attacking the pawn oh it's plus six nothing to worry about i was just worried that my i wasn't going to get the pawn up oh, it's plus seven dude what are you on about and they're pushing we get the check on and i didn't think i was going to get my king across to be able to protect you know to get here then i thought also be able to come come down and I think it was more so here. Yeah, I thought, oh my gosh, he could just come down and get my pawn. Yeah. That's where I thought, oh man, he's, he's going to get my pawn. But we probably do have this pushing up. Because he has to think about doing this. So it's uh, here. Oh, sorry, that was wrong. Yeah, so he's coming for the pawn. I can't defend it. If I pushed up, it's not going to help, but it takes the king further away. So he takes, get the, oh, get the king across. Yeah, that's not too bad. I'm happy with that. Don't doubt myself. Nice one.